Uh, northern corn leaf blight, of course, has always been our most problematic foliar leaf disease in corn, and it continues to be, and we see it going through cycles. And again, over the past two or three years, growers as well as industry folks have seen an increase again in terms of northern corn leaf blight. And uh, not unusual, because at different races, all of these different pathogens have ability to mutate, change, become better disease organisms and cause disease. They always keep us on our toes yeah. because no matter what we send out there to fight them, they find a way to go around those defenses. Yeah. Really important uh, with all these diseases to determine their incidence and severity. Incidence basically means how much is in there. One plant out of 100, 1%. The more incidence, the broader the uh, the impact of that disease across that field, but more important is the severity. And in regardless there is how much damage is being occurred or how much leaf area is being impacted. And for northern corn leaf blight, a great example is when we're at there rating and others and screening trials, you're going from 1% to higher levels. So the more that you are, those one, two, three percent or or lower, you want to stay on that end. Once you start getting 10, 15, 20 percent, you can see how much leaf area is gone or compromised and that's where the yield impact hits.